Hello, I'm Aga from Arvis Artist. Today I'll show you how to create a quick script combining some options used very often. This is a great way to automate some tasks and save some time. ago I shared with you the video where I show you the grid method to use the chamfer modifier. If you haven't watched it yet, the link will be in the corner. I very often make a script out of the things I do repeatedly. There is no point to lose time every time I do the same thing. You should always try to automate as many things as possible. So without any further ado, let me show you how to do it. Here is the script. It chamfers the edges with quirk smoothing and adds triple smooth modifier on top. It saves me one minute each time I use it. Let me show you what we have there. Triple smooth on top, then chamfer modifier with 1mm amount, 2 segments and 0.5 tension. Minimum angle is set to 45. On the bottom we have another chamfer modifier, but this time with 1.5mm amount, one segment and tension set to zero. Now I will delete it and show you how to make a script out of it. First, we have to turn on the script listener, right click here and open the listener window. If you have it like that, you have to make a pink area larger. Next. Go to Macro Recorder and click on Enable. Now, each operation we do is gonna be recorded. So, if I draw a box, we'll have a script written to create the box. If I add a modifier, we will get the script for this modifier. So now, let's record the whole chamfer process. And it's done. Now let's copy only these lines of the code. Use Ctrl C shortcut, then go to scripting, create a new script and paste our code. Close the listener window. I will delete the modifiers from my object to show you how the script works. Go to Tools and click Evaluate All. We are missing the first chamfer. We can copy this line of code to fix it. Let's do it again. 
Now it's perfect. If you want to adjust some options, just change them inside the modifier like usual. You can save this script and use it later. Save it as MCR. If you want to use it, go to Scripting, Run Script and select it. If you want to add it to a toolbar as I have, you can learn how to do it from my previous video. You can find the link in the corner or in the description. That's it! I hope you learned something new today. If you want to get the full knowledge on how we optimize everything in 3ds Max, plus all our quads, shortcuts, toolbars with scripts and icons, library structure, layer structures, templates and more, make sure you check out our brand new course focusing on this topic. The link will be in the description. Okay, I think that's it for today. Thanks for watching and also don't forget to like this video if you found this interesting, share it, subscribe and do all these wonderful things. See you guys in the next video.